Oh, it's Vadil. See, I told you guys he was teamed. He's got full eye and his teammate is pretty stacked. Hey, how's it going guys and welcome back to a brand new episode of the Minecraft Soul Games and today we're here playing on Breeze Island 2. Let's go ahead and get right to spawn here. Oh, we got a stone sword. No, we didn't get it. No. Um, where's my chest food? Oh, I gotta go north. Oh, this guy with a weapon. That was my weapon. But, um, yeah, I'm actually going the wrong way. No. I have to go the other way. Hopefully this guy doesn't have a weapon. <gasps> get away, get away, get away. All right. Um... I gotta remember my uh, chest route here. I always go, I always tend to go north, but my chest route is south, so <laughs> it's kind of stupid. Um, looks like somebody's already going here, which is not great. Oh, he's waiting. He's got that axe. <gasps> oh, ah, nice boost, nice boost. Let's grab a weapon. All right, <laughs> where are you at? Oh, <laughs> I think he failed the parkour like big time. All right, um, looks like he doesn't want to go this way, so. Well, let me just grab all these Ted 2s over here. Um, ooh, oh my god, we just failed. We're using like a ice pack on a tropic map, so that's kind of funny. But, um, yes, make our way up this mountain here. We've got three chests in the waterfall. I think um, one or two of them are Ted 2s. I'm not too sure. At least one, so that's pretty nice. And then we've also got one more Ted 2 up the mountain and then there's also another tattoo on the back end of the mountain and then if you're lucky enough there's another tattoo over there maybe we can uh, grab that one as well let's focus on getting like these tattoos up here I'm pretty sure like a lot of people know about this route and uh, a lot of people actually tend to go here at least when I play on Breeze Island dude there's always like three to four players here which I don't like how do people know this route this is like I found this route like almost dead. <laughs> I found this route like two years ago. Yeah, so basically you like jump through these trees and then over here you got yourself a nice little Ted 2. Let's make a flint steel. There we go. That, I don't want to take more fall damage here so we're gonna make our way down slowly. Um, right. Oh, so many tier 1s here. Like back on NCSG I don't think they were all there. There's like a one tier one up there. Now there's just like 20. <laughs> oh, we got another diamond. Great, we can make a diamond sword. There's actually a crafting table on a little pirate ship nearby. So we'll go do that. Um, let's loot this one last tier two and then head back to spawn. I'd like to get a bow as well. So if we don't grab a bow from this tier two, I am gonna go loot for one. All right, got leggings. We don't have a helmet. It's weird. Usually like <laughs> I have 20 helmets. After going my chest roots. Alright, got a stick as well, so we can craft a diamond sword now. Let's just see. Okay, we got a helmet. So all we need now is a bow. Let's quickly grab that. There's a guy in here actually, so we have to be a bit careful. Alright, there we go. I think he had a golden apple on himself. He had two golden apples on himself, and we are full iron now. We still don't have a bow though. We have 35 arrows, dude. I'd love to get a bow right now. Alright, there we go, and then also let's make a couple of more arrows here, you cannot have enough arrows on this map. Oh my god, yo did somebody die right here? Oh my goodness, yo let me burn all of this good stuff, look at this. Oh, I just burned sticks on accident, but I think somebody just like disconnected here. Because I mean there's like full iron on the ground and like nobody looted it, so <laughs> I'm guessing somebody disconnected. Feel bad for him. Alright, there's only five players remaining, and we haven't, like, fought anybody except for that one guy in the cave. I wanna, I wanna fight people, come on, I'm really stacked. By now we have almost a stack of arrows, so... Maybe there's, like, a two-team left? That would actually be pretty nice right now. I know this, uh, Riddell guy, he's usually in teams, or, like, I've seen him team a lot, so... Maybe he's gonna be teaming again. Um, I think we have, we have enough secondaries to take out a team here. I feel pretty confident. So, um, yeah, let's just wait at spawn here. I, I don't know where to go. Usually, like, people come to spawn at this point in time. Alright, there we go. There's, there's one guy. This is the guy that got the stone sword off of spawn. He's actually full iron now, so I think that stone sword helped him out a lot. Alright, he's already running. He saw my diamond sword, and 
He's gonna play very defensive now. Fine by me. But please just don't run for like ages. Ugh, it's so annoying. Like his play style, he just like. Alright, we got another crit on him. He's just gonna run though, so. If we can get him in the water. Should be really low at this point, so I'm just gonna try and continue to bow him. Oh, his playstyle, it's really annoying because, like, he's just running, he's gonna bow here. Or not. I mean, I'm low myself because I'm just trying to play aggro against somebody like this. Alright, got another shot on him. He should be really low at this time. Alright, shot him again. Shot him again. Shot him again. Alright, there we go, we killed him. Oh, luckily I was able to kill him here because his playstyle was just so annoying. Like, he just kept running away and just, like, waited for the perfect time to rod quit me. But at the same time, you know, he did have a stone sword. So, I guess, you know, he had to play like that. But you know, we were able to kill him here. He crafted a diamond sword, by the way. So, um, I think he was just trying to run away and, like, craft. Which, you know, he did in the end. But he got some nice bow shots on him. So, we were able to kill him. So the guy that we just killed, he's actually got pretty decent stats. He's 38 out of 122, which means that he like wins every third game. So that was definitely a decent player. Um, my stats aren't that good anymore. I think I'm like, yeah, I'm one out of four. So like I won every fourth game, but I just wanted to get like 100 wins. And since then, I've just been messing around. I really don't care that much about my stats. You know, obviously, you know, it's, it's nice to have like good stats, but at the same time, you know, like, for example, if, like, I play with a friend and he dies, like, I just YOLO it. Like, I don't I don't play, like, carefully. I just play really reckless and uh, don't care if I win because, you know, I just... I, I want to play for fun and playing sweaty isn't always fun. So, that's, you know, that is that. So, I don't really... I don't sweat for stats. Obviously, you know, I do want to win the game. I'm a competitive person, but I don't mind if I lose. Like, I don't care. And I'm also not going to do, like, everything to win a game. Oh, it's Vadil! See? I told you guys he was teamed. Alright, let's see if we can kill him. Um, he's in a two-team here, so... I'm just going to back off. He's got full eye, and his teammate is pretty stacked. The only thing I don't like about Breeze Island is that you don't have good fighting ground here, right? This is a nice spot to just, like, bow spam them. I mean, I can just kill them with my arrows, basically, here. Alright. <laughs> Where are they going? I think they're, like, getting stuck here. Oh, I placed a flint steel behind him. Oh, he walked into it. <laughs> That's funny, dude. Uh, Alright. Let's go after him now. Preferably, I want to kill him before deathmatch ends. Oh, what the? How did I not get that hit? Alright, there we go, we killed him as well, let's eat a golden apple here, hopefully we don't get cleaned, um, and yeah, this is looking pretty decent, we took out that two team, that was actually a really nice spot, let me remember that, so if you go west, right here, there's like this small passage right here, and like if somebody tries to come, they're gonna get like stuck against the vines, and you can just like bow spam them to death, so it's definitely a pretty good spot to take out teams, if you guys ever like end up in like a 1v2 situation, um, If he goes into the water, that, that's like a free shot, but we didn't get it, but we got that Katniss. That is what matters. Oh my god, yo. <laughs> Hopefully you guys did all enjoy this episode of the Minecraft Solo Games. If you guys did, make sure to smash that like button. Let's go for 45 likes here. I know I usually don't do like goals, but yeah, let's try and crush that. And yeah, I'll see you guys all in the next one. Peace.